The following is a Sports South original program. It doesn't matter what it is, we want to compete with the best. No regrets, man. Let's do what we got to do. I understood the passion for Ole Miss and for Ole Miss athletics. People like a winner. A baby, good. Well, there's nothing like this place when it's uh, at a very, very high, high level. <laughs> Ole Miss is a feeling. Ole Miss is something that, that truly unites our people. Welcome back to Spotlight, Ole Miss Athletics. We're here in the Tad Smith Coliseum with head basketball coach Andy Kennedy, better known as the Tad Pad. Uh, and you know, it's a really intimate atmosphere in here. Talk to me a little bit about what kind of advantage your team has playing in a small arena like this. Well, as you can see, the fans are right on top of you, most especially in the ends, and uh, they can certainly create a, a true home court advantage for us by being our sixth man. Uh, it's an old building, a lot of concrete, so the acoustics are such that if we can get the noise level up, it has a it has a, a echoing effect that, that uh, for us has been advantageous. Yeah, this can be a really tough place to play. There have been seasons when when you were uh, this team was undefeated at home here. Yeah, you know we haven't done as good a job as of late at, as protecting our home floor, but it's not because uh, our fans haven't been supportive. Uh, it is a place that, that it has an intimate feel, it has a feel of, of energy, and again, if we can get the bodies energized and give them something to be excited about, then there's a lot of electricity in the air. No regrets, man. Let's do what we got to do. We ain't going to be here long. Let's put some work in. All I, all I ask is you be all in, all in on three. One, two, three. All here in. we go, here we go. Let's go, man. Don't waste your time. Get loose. Get loose so we can get better. Let's go. Be efficient. Catch, wipe, turn, dive. Now, you're a, a native of the state of Mississippi. Talk to me a little bit about growing up, what you remember about Ole Miss athletics. You know, the, the, when, when I took this job, uh, I hadn't been back in the state in quite some time. I grew up about 100 miles south of here. But I, but Louisville. I Louisville. Not Louisville. That's right. Those Louisville. People, those people in Kentucky have a hard time with the enunciation. It's Louisville, spelled like Louisville. Um, and I, I took this job without having to step foot back on this campus, and I hadn't been on this campus in quite some time, simply because I understood the passion uh, for Ole Miss and for Ole Miss athletics. Uh, you know, we're the University of Mississippi, but we're more commonly referred to as Ole Miss because Ole Miss is a feeling. Ole Miss is something that, that truly uh, unites our people, uh, and that's something that I wanted to be a part of. Outside of the obvious draw of coming back to your home state, what is it about this school, this program, uh, the facilities here that really wanted you, made you want to be the head coach here? Well, I grew up first and foremost following the SEC, uh, and for me to have the opportunity to be the head coach in my home state of an SEC program is truly a dream come true. I also wanted to, to, to try to do something that many people told me that you can't do, and that is to sustain a high level of success at this program. Good drink, sweet to work. Don't let it push you down. Come on, Don. Good stride, good long stride, Nick. That's what you gotta do in the game. Stride long, trust it, man. I truly believe that, that we're taking steps to doing just that. Are we there yet? Not close, but we are moving the program in the direction where I think that is becoming a reality for us. Our administration has been tremendously supportive in doing the things that we need to do in order to enhance our facilities to give ourselves a chance to compete uh, with the best of the best in this league. And uh, I feel very fortunate to, to be in this position at this time because I think we're right on the verge of really taking this next step. When you talk about taking that next step, you know, you came in and did have a lot of early success, couple first couple of years uh, that really turned this program around from what they had known. Uh, and, and it's almost unfair to ask, but the secret to that success, what is your formula? What is it that you do here at Ole Miss that you really, really try to build a winning program? We're trying to sell a vision. We're trying to say that, hey, if we come in and take the right approach, then we can be successful. There's a lot of talented prospects in the state of Mississippi and throughout the southeast. Uh, there's a lot of people that once we get them on this campus and they see all the things that we have to offer from an academic standpoint, from a community standpoint, and then obviously SEC Athletics speaks for itself, I think people get excited about the potential. Well, Coach, you talked about some of those new facilities. Uh, I understand you got a brand new one here on campus. Will you show it to me? Yeah, I would love to. Let's go take a look. 
Coach, this is really a fantastic facility. Open, open, open what, a year? Yeah, we've been in here a year, and it's, uh, it's been tremendous for us. First, from an efficiency standpoint, it allows us to uh, operate around our guys' class schedule. We have no conflict with, with the women who we were sharing the court with for practice time and Tad Smith. And also from a recruiting standpoint, it shows that there is a true commitment to, to giving our student athletes everything that is necessary in order to be successful. Now walking through here, you really get a sense of, of a lot of thought going into the design. Talk about some of the amenities here. Well, there, we've got a little bit of everything. Our, our training room, our weight room are right here on site. Obviously our offices are off the, the main floor, which we've got six baskets which are a 24-hour accessible to our guys. We've got a, a player's lounge, film room, state-of-the-art locker rooms, everything that our kids could need. And the best part is it's the, there's a mirror facility. It's the women have the same exact thing you guys do. Exactly, 51,000 square feet, exactly what we have, they have on the other side of the building. We share the training room and the weight room. Uh, everything else is available for our guys. Again, 24 hours a day for them to come in and, and do the things they need to do to prepare themselves for life in the SEC. All right, now you've been a coach a while, haven't played, but I understand you can still stroke it pretty good. I can still stroke it, but it would take a better coach than me to get me open. Put me on the spot. But if, but I won't guard you at all. But if I can get open, I can still knock it down. Unbelievable. Still can drain it. Good stuff, guys. Hey, thanks. <laughs>